formulas that are available to calculate this uh, PV ratio. So PV ratio may be in short called as what? PVR also sometimes. So the abbreviation of this is profit volume ratio. So how to calculate this? Uh, let us see how, what are the formulas that are available. So PV ratio is equal to contribution per unit. This is the first formula you can use divided by selling price per unit. So whenever you take contribution per unit, you have to take selling price also per unit and multiply it with 100. So for PV ratio, you keep in mind this, uh, the result will be in percentage. So because you are multiplying it with 100. Okay. Whenever you multiply it with 100, the result, whatever you get, you uh, indicate it as percentage. So instead of contribution per unit, you can replace the formula of contribution per unit in this uh, place and you can use. So PV ratio is equal to directly I am taking the formula of contribution per, uh, per unit. So that is selling price per unit minus variable cost per unit. So this will give you contribution per unit, right? The same formula I am replacing here. So divided by selling price per unit into 100. Okay, selling price per unit into 100. So this is one formula which you can use whenever per unit values are given in the problem. And the second formula that you can calculate is uh, total contribution divided by so whenever it is here total contribution you are taking you have to take the denominator also total so instead of selling price per unit you take as here total sales okay so total contribution divided by total sales into 100 is common or you can uh, replace the total contribution formula in total contribution so that uh, what is the formula for calculating total contribution total sales minus total variable cost okay so that will give you total contribution so instead of total contribution you can use this uh, in the formula itself total sales minus total variable cost divided by total sales into 100 so these are the two formulas and the third formula whenever there is no information related with the per unit or uh, uh, per unit or totals uh, two values two periods values will be given sometimes that means two in two periods what are the sales and in uh, two periods what are the profits will be given so in such a case you can use this formula third one so that is change in profits divided by change in sales there you you you, you won't have uh, the information related with variable cost or fixed cost so in such case you can use this formula into 100 into 100 is common okay so these are the three formulas that are available to calculate the pv ratio depending on the information so depending on the information you use one of the formula okay so these are the formulas of pv ratios 